As someone who cares for others, you can find yourself in situations where your plans for providing care don't work the way you intended. Get away! I don't need my face washed. I'm... Don't touch me! Get out I'm of here! Sorry, Mrs. Braun. I'm leaving now. I'll be back in a little bit. I'll report you. You shouldn't be in here. Hey, Sunita. What's going on? Is everything okay? Yes, um, Mrs. Braun's having a bit of a rough morning. She's not being very cooperative. Um, Cheryl? Do you have a second to give Sunita a hand? Sure. What's up? Well, I was trying to give her face a little wash after breakfast, but she's in one of her moods. Okay. No problem. Thank you. Okay, so let's approach her slowly and just get in there and wash her face and leave as soon as we can. All right. And just watch for her hands. She gets kind of grabby, okay? All right. What are you doing in here? The solution is often to get another worker to help without understanding why the plan didn't work the first time. Get out! Get out! And don't come back! This scene started off with Sunita realizing she needed to stop what she was doing. You may have noticed that before re-entering the room, there was no discussion of what may have made Mrs. Braun unhappy in the first place. The solution of adding a second worker presumes that whatever didn't work for Sunita will be corrected by adding Cheryl's help. In this case, adding a second person did not reduce the risk and it may have made the situation worse. Let's try a different approach to that scene. Get out of here, you dozy cow. Go away. I'll I'm sorry, you. Mrs. Braun. I'm leaving now. Leave I'll be alone. back in a little bit. I'll report you. Hey, Sunita. What's going on? Is everything OK? Oh, Mrs. Braun, she's having a rough morning. She's not being very cooperative. Did you sense what was bothering her? No, she just got really upset. All right, well, let's go look at her care plan, check her chart, and see if there are any new alerts. Let's figure out what the best strategy for Mrs. Braun might be. Okay. If you encounter a problem delivering care, discuss possible options with the care team. If the strategy involves adding a second person, define a specific role for each worker. In this case, Sunita will enter the room first and determine if it is safe to proceed. Cheryl's role is to follow Sunita's lead and distract Mrs. Braun. Okay, let me go in there first and make sure she's not so upset. Now, if she's calmed down, I'll call you in. Sounds good. Right? Who is it? Hi, Mrs. Braun. It's Sunita. How are you doing? Is it lunchtime yet? Well, not just yet. I'd like to finish washing your face, if that's okay. No! I want to go outside. I heard that your son came and visited you yesterday. Yes. Yes. We, we went into the garden. Well, I'll bet that was fun. Would you mind if Cheryl joined us? Cheryl? Oh, Cheryl. I like Cheryl. She's, she's funny. <laughs> Cheryl, come on in. Good morning, Mrs. Braun. How are you feeling? My son is going to come visit this afternoon. How nice. Is that Scott or David? Scott. And we're going to the garden to look at the flowers. How lovely. Yes. It's a lovely day today, isn't it? When providing care, your initial plan may not always work out. Be willing to step back and reassess the situation. Before adding a second worker, remember, two-person care needs a planned approach.